The genocide of the Muslims of the state of Jammu and Kashmir had started in 1947 when some 200,000 one Muslims were killed mercilessly by the forces of Maharaja Hari Singh aided by right-wing Hindu groups and six though a report published by the Times on the 10th of August 1948 had put the figure as 237,000. In November 1947, thousands of Muslims were killed in Jammu by paramilitaries led by the army of Dogra ruler Hari Singh. The massacres took place in the presence of the then Jammu and Kashmir's Prime Minister Meher Chand Mahajan and the Governor of Jammu, Lala Chet Ram Chopra, and that some of those who led these riots in Udhampur and Bhadewa later joined the National Conference with some of them also serving as ministers. There was no humanity shown at that time. The exact number of casualties in the killings that continued for two months is not known, but estimates range from 20,000 to 237,000, and nearly half million forced into displacement across the border into the newly created nation of Pakistan and its admin. ministered part of kashmir the incident divided families there were a lot of muslims in jammu but now you won't find many the killings triggered a series of events including a war between two newly independent nations of india and pakistan which gave birth to kashmir dispute the killings took place when millions of muslims hindus and sikhs were crossing the border from the one side to the other as part of british designed plan to partition the subcontinent into india and pakistan the immediate impact of partition was in jammu The Muslim subjects from different parts of Jammu province were forcibly displaced by the Dogra army in a program of expulsion and murder carried out over 3 weeks between October November 1947 in mid October the Dogra army troops began expelling Muslim villagers from Jammu province The refugees were sent on foot toward West Punjab later to form part of Pakistan where most were accommodated in refugee camps in the districts of Sialkot Jhelum Gujarat and Rawalpindi Five days after the Jammu killings, tribal militias from Pakistan's northwestern frontier province, now Khyber Pakhtunkhwa, where many of the Jammu Muslims had family ties, invaded Kashmir. As the army of Pashtun tribesmen rushed to Kashmir, the army of Dogra monarch fled to Jammu. The King Hari Singh signed the instrument of accession with New Delhi, which sent its army to fight the Pashtun tribesmen. The fighting of several weeks between Pashtun tribesmen and Indian army eventually led to First India-Pakistan War. When New Delhi and Islamabad agreed to a ceasefire in January 1948, the formerly princedom of Jammu and Kashmir was divided between the two countries. The conflict born in 1947 has led to three wars between India and Pakistan. An estimated 70,000 people have been killed in the violence in past three decades since the armed revolt against Indian rule broke out in the region in 1989. The perpetual conflict in Kashmir has its roots in 1947 massacre. It is deliberately forgotten. Actually, the violence of that massacre in 1947 continues. Those who were forced to migrate to Pakistan have never been allowed to return.